Hello, welcome back to Learn Economia. Today we are going to discuss the answer to the question how does recession affect an individual? So let's consider the answer to this. Moving to the idea of recession, you can find that this would involve significant decline in economic activity that would be persisting for a sustained period of time. In such a scenario, we can find that we are talking about a declining period. We are talking about a kind of economic loss coming in. So business would be facing certain difficulties. There would be so much of unemployment scenario in the economy. People would be losing employment. So that is something that happens. So job loss would come. And general slowdown of the economy would be happening. So that means that there would be less production. Production would come. So people will have uh, less money with them. Because their income is less. Again, so that would uh, consider a situation of stance scenario. So let's consider the details of how recession would affect you or how recession would affect an individual. It will be considered under the implications of recession on individuals. So the first thing that we have here is job loss. Job loss can be very, very common during a period of recession. This is because companies would be struggling very, very much financially. So, there would be less money with the company. Company would be having a lack of money situation. So, they would try to adjust with their existing money. They would try to adjust with their existing finances. So, what they can do? They would try to downside their workforce. So, that will lead to several layoffs. So, you are losing your job as a result of some causes that is happening in the economy. It's not due to your mistake that you are losing your job. So, such kind of a scenario would be coming and also when you lose a job, uh, once you lose a job, it would be very much difficult for you to secure the next employment. So, what happens here? The period of frictional unemployment. This would be increasing so because once you lose a job uh, you won't be able to get a new job as soon as possible so there would be reduced working hours as well as reduced income etc so some companies will be uh, converting some full-time workers into part-time workers that will reduce uh, the income of this uh, that kind of workers etc this is all due to the financial strain experienced by the company. Okay. So, this is what which lead to financial issues for the individual. Why? Because we could find that income has already come down. Now, we need to adjust with our budget. So, budget would definitely have implication for this. Your consumption expenditure will be having some implication as a result of this. Definitely, when income comes down, your personal finances would be affecting. It would get affected, isn't it? So, harder to meet the financial obligations with the limited income, such a kind of situation would be coming. So, you might be having several, several expenditure to deal with, several, several obligations, financial obligations to meet. Like uh, you might be having some uh, rent expenditure. You might have placed some uh, uh, kind of assets in your bank uh, so as to get a loan. So you need to pay interest for that loan. Definitely there might be other expenses. Uh, there would be other expenses to deal with the life. But life with this limited uh, income would be highly, highly problematic for a particular person so he would be finding it very much difficult to save money because the income is limited so savings and investment for future would be dropping 
नेक्स्ट आई टोल्ड दैट इनकम इज ऑलवेज लिमिटेड हियर इन द पीरियड ऑफ रेसेशन सो वॉट अबाउट स्पेंडिंग यू नीड टू कट शॉर्ट योर एक्सपेंडिचर यू माइट कट बैक ऑन स्पेंडिंग and uh, you would be very much cautious related to uh, making your expenditure this is not like a positive kind of thought that you are having uh, right now because this is a very bad situation for the economy and definitely as far as an individual is concerned this would be affecting you very badly it would negatively impact your spending it would negatively impact your investment saving business everything so all together we are considering a situation of stress financial stress or you call it as the financial strain or crisis then what about the housing market housing market is not an exception here housing market too gets affected as a result of recession definitely there is a decline trend that will be coming with respect to the property values so what would happen when property values decline it will offer problems for the individual who would be selling their houses or if they try to access a new house or equity house based equity it will be creating problems to such individual so what happens to the people it would be definitely definitely harder for the people to qualify for mortgages because your asset is losing the value in that asset has a loss of value we are talking about property asset we are talking about housing market real estate sector then what about investment i was just telling earlier that investment would be coming down yes investment would decline you can talk about some stock market investment bond market investment mutual funds investment in mutual funds so all these would be showing a decline so what would decline lead to decline would lead to loss and thus it will be creating a kind of discouragement for the prospective investment investors to make their investment so plan to investment that too would get postponed altogether we could find that uh, it will impact retirement savings as well also other kind of investment portfolio to get a kind of impact as a result of recession what about government support and policies here comes the role of government so if you look back to 1930s the 1930s if you talk about the depression the great depression of 1930s so this is what happened this was actually what happened the government will go for fiscal stimulus packages that kind of measures would become very very essential so fiscal stimulus measures would be taken by the government this is very much required to equip or revive the economy so as to ensure that uh, the government is supporting economy and individuals so what the government can do here is that the government would be providing tax breaks to the people it will be providing some subsidies it will be providing some kind of unemployment benefits because you have already lost lost your job and uh, you are having limit less income or no income situation so government should assist you right so this is very much important to mitigate uh, the impact of recession so also such kind of a policy uh, action combination would be stimulating the economy to have a recovery phase so we can say that uh, all together when it comes to the impact of recession it will be having a uh, specific implications uh, for different different categories but all together we are talking about a declining phase so in general we are talking about a decline we are talking about a loss but uh, 
there would be some specific characteristic feature of uh, different different economy uh, affecting here so as to make some differences in the extent to which people would be uh, having its impact so based on several factors you can assess the impact of recession on individual you need to take into consideration the severity of recession that is important some recession would be less severe whereas some other recession would be much much more severe if you talk about the 2008 crisis so it was a little uh, more severe but when when you compare what happened in 1930s with what happened in 2008 so this was highly highly severe compared to what happened in 2008 now the duration of recession whether it would be lasting for a long duration or a short duration if it is a long duration how long it is that too matter then government responses how fast government is able to respond and uh, that would be again a matter of concern here and the individual circumstances would be different person a's situation might not be same as what we have with person b person a might be having uh, some other source of income apart from his job but uh, person b might be having his job as the only source of income so what would happen if these two people are laid off as a result of recession for a it would be something adjustable with his other sources of income but for b it would be very very problematic phase so it's very very important to deal with proactive steps in managing with the personal finances uh, it's very much important focus on the essential expenses because here you need to prioritize uh, irrespective of the presence or absence of depression or recession you are supposed to prioritize your requirements because you are having a limited income but when it comes to the phase of a recession uh, this prioritizing becomes more important and definitely you will be trying to explore new job opportunities but i was telling earlier the period of frictional unemployment would be more here and uh, it's very important to seek uh, some support from the government programs uh, and also it's very important to get some financial advice from financial advisors all these are important to navigate the issues posed by a recession so that's it uh, thank you hope you could understand uh, and i request you to like share and subscribe to our channel for more videos you can join our free telegram community i'll be providing the link in the description box also you can download the learn economy app for which also i'll be providing the link in the description box thank you